also don't. I don't understand. What don't you understand? What is the meaning of this? The meaning of what? Yeah? Oh, go put it now, Bakasia. Relax, Kwanu now. Yeah? Look, I personally went to the market to get all those things for the woman I love. Yeah? Listen, I love you so much. I am crazy about you. And, I, and from the look of things, you know how the country is now. Everywhere, don't they, Nepo? Yeah? There's no way I'm letting you go hungry. And who told you that I am hungry? Olisa, I am asking you, did I ever come to you to cry of hunger? Eh? Uh, why are you talking like this now? Yeah? What kind of a man am I? Or probably what kind of a boyfriend will I be if I allow you yeah, to complain first before going to the market if to get your things? that is the lie you tell yourself yeah? to put you to sleep, then so be it. Because you are a fool. Uh, a big fool, yes. What? what do you mean by what do I mean? Yes, you are a fool. These things you brought here are stolen goods. Things you stole from vulnerable market women who are in debt. You take their goods and bring them to me to come and feed who? Hungry Lotachi. Eh? Yeah, yeah, look, let me tell you. Carry your stolen goods with your jobless friends and the curse you carry around this whole village and get out of my father's compound. Yes, 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 yeah, see. You need to slow down now, eh? How can a man like Olise? Be packaging you with good, good stuffs, eh? Look at now, granola, yeah, noodles, even Fanta. You're saying no. Remember, oh, maka hunger. Uh, hunger. I should accept accumulated costs. Yes, people crying and begging for mercy. These are their, these are their things, and they have laid curses on all of you. See, Olisa, I am begging you. Carry yourself and your useless friends and get out of my father's compound this minute. Uh, relax, uh, I don't blame you. I blame myself for accepting to come to this place at the first place. Yes. yes. You're going to pre come. You that I'm sure that they gave birth to you by mistake. I'm sure your father did not want to come. He just by mistake put it inside your mother and they came and gave birth to a mistake like you. You're opening your mouth to talk. The only thing you do in this village is follow, follow. Follow, Lisa. I'm sure by now your mother will be turning in her grave for this for this attitude of yours. But is it me you're talking to? Hey, 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 hey. Don't you? Oh, this is so new. Calm down, calm down, down, calm down, huh? Yeah, 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 what is this now? What is what? Look at what you're doing to a very big guy. What do you mean which big guy? Huh? You are. You big guy. You that goes from head to toe. My friend, get out of my father's no, compound. Get out. Get out. You want me to come out? I said get out. Guys, you guys move it. Which one are movement? All those things you're doing is becoming too much. It's becoming too much. Oh, it's like, I, don't I don't take bullshit from nobody, bro. You don't take bullshit. Yeah? No, come, let me pull another one. Oh, come, Bob Mali. Get out from this place. You love who? Go, stand there. Let me pour this thing on you again. No sense. Go go and buy belt and, and, and hold your clothes. Why are you not taking care of yourself? No, come, let me empty the bottle. Not touchy! Papa! Papa, you're welcome. Mama, good afternoon. Is this not palm oil I see on the ground? Um. Yes. No, sorry. I, I mean, yes. Um, the thing is, I. I went to the market to buy oils. So on, on my way back, I, I slipped here and the oil fell and spilled. All, all over the place. Oh. So this is how you waste my money in the name of going to the market to buy food stuff. No, Papa, it, it was a mistake. And how come you went to the market to buy oil? 
I thought we still have some oil remaining in the house. So why? Yes, we, we do. The thing is, I, I didn't really buy it. Um, Ginika gave it to me for, for free because of the help I rendered to her. Mama, remember what I told you some days ago? Oh, 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 oh yes, I remember. I remember. But how come you pour the oil on the ground like this, knowing fully well how these things are expensive in the market now? Why? I am. Huh? I'm sorry. See, you are very lucky. You are lucky because it is not my money you use in buying this palm oil. You know what I would have done? You would have packed this palm oil and used it to cook for me. And God save you. If I see a grain of sand in my food, you are very lucky. So sorry, Papa. Is food ready? All your fault. Look at what she did to me. It's your fault. You advised me to buy food stores for this girl. Look at what she did to me. Look at the, the, the level of the disrespect. I will give money. They pay you or you. The truth is, you know, who would have thought that anyone in his right senses is going to reject food stuff? Especially in this tedious time. It's not my fault. How was I supposed to know? Uh, uh, Police, if you will take my cordial advice, I will say that you should leave that Lukashu of the girl alone. Yes! Because with what she did today is a clear show that she doesn't have any form of respect for me. And if she continue on this path, you see? All the villagers that fear and respect you will start disrespecting you. By the time they join, they will, they, they will, they will, they will disrespect you. No, the villagers will disrespect you. Look, I've told you time without number to get my woman's name out of your mouth. Listen, the next time you say this name, Lotachi, eh? the next time I hear Lotachi from your mouth, I will cut off your tongue. Fine, it's okay, it's okay by me. If that's what you want, I will make sure that anything I have to do with Tachi, I will not involve myself. Even though that I went there with you, I would have experienced this eyesore. Okay. This form of disrespect you, from that so-called Otashi you call again. Are, are you raising your voice? I'm not raising my voice at you, I'm just angry. Get out of here. Stop! You're, 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 you're raising your voice at me. I'm going. Listen, my friend. Yeah? The truth is, I won't even take your attention to this position. Yes, because when you continue to show your affection to us, maybe someday she's going to realize that love kill you, dear. Someday, I love kill you, dear. What? Okay, you know, you they advise me, say, follow up with this one, do this one, do that one. Later, later, you're going to laugh me with this idiot that just walked out of here. It's eh? not my fault. Come on, come on, come on. Natasha, huh? Is it this palm oil? Yes, my dear, it is. How can you be careless enough to allow this amount of palm oil to waste just like that? Nem, I didn't allow it to waste intentionally. It's Olisa. Olisa came here with his stupid friends, brought with barrow and brought some, some food stuff that he came to give it to me. No, as a hungry person now. Huh? Well, I had to tell him to take it back that I'm not hungry. Neither am I going to partake in his curse because I'm sure those food stuff were stolen. Yes, now. He collected them from those vulnerable women who are in debt. Am I supposed to partake in that in his curse? When he refused to leave, I had to empty my bottle of oil on him. And then he left with his food stuff. Hey! Why are you shouting? It's again. You did what? Did you, you know reject that food stuffs? Lota? You know where? No. Why will you do that? Were you the one that looted those market women? No. So, how can you share in the course? Who is in your body? No, I want to know who is speaking through you because I don't understand Nigeria this. Nigeria is speaking through me. The economy of this Nigeria is bad. He's speaking through me. 
full stops are now considered luxury. So if you see someone that gives it to you, ah, that person loves you. That person adores you. Hey, Lota. Lota. Um, but why don't you consider Ulisa? Hey? Consider him for once. Can't you see he's trying everything to make you understand that he loves you? To be over my dead body, not Olisa. Of all people, not Olisa. What do you have to lose? It's for your own good. Yeah? Hmm? It seems you don't have anything meaningful to say. Ngwa. Hey, wait. Go now, to your okay, house. Fine, wait, wait. <coughs> what nonsense is this? No, no. <laughs> I'm only trying to help you. Eh? Ha! Amara. Why is it that you don't see this kind of man that will be bringing you foodstuffs? It is well, look. Inside well, it is well. Uh, so you have food in the house. Uh, Auntie, no get, Auntie, we're not get sense. There's food. Uh, you don't have sense. You, you don't even get sense. You want to date somebody that does not have sense. Uh, go inside. Somebody there's... bring foodstuffs. Ah! Natasha, you fuck up. Go inside. There's a the place of food. Yeah. Ha! There's food and there's meat inside. Mm. Let me start from that one. Make sure you don't eat the only meat inside that food, though. That is where I'm starting from. Hey! This my friend does not have sense. I'm sure when God finished creating her, he went to the backyard to laugh. Because this one, common sense, no day hurts. How to take it? Of all people, this life. Mm, I'll call me. It's okay. We have to be going now, so All right. I will go and teach you what I mean. <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> All right, um, waiter. Come on. Don't worry, you've had enough already. So, how much is our bill? Matt is your money now, 75,000. Okay. How dare you? Are you stupid? How dare you call or call me by his name? You don't have respect. I'm sorry, they call him. Now, so you they call him. Um, Fumila, your hair is nothing. It's nothing. She just addressed me by my name. What do you mean by it's nothing? Call, call me. So this is what you've been doing. No, it's obvious you two have something. Hey, what is that? What is wrong with you, Fumila? What do you mean by what is wrong with me? How in heaven's sake do you expect me to be having something with a waitress? Oh! Why would she call you by your name? Oh, call me! You be coming here, regular customer! What do you come here to do? Fumilayo, can we just go? Go where? Go where? Answer me! Because in our regular customer, I can call him by his name. Don't be saying anything. Are you stupid? I am... I... Oh, yeah. Okay! Look at this fool! Yeah. Mess at once. What is wrong with you? What do you mean? What is Why are you constituting nuisance here? Me! Uh, and me for me, like you! Constituting nuisance! Hello, hello, what's going on here? Who is this one? Um, manager. Oh, sorry, it's nothing. It's just. Oh, you even know that. Um, okay, it's okay. Um, I will sort it out. Hello? You will hello, sort it you. out. You will sort it out. You will sort it out. I will show you how to sort it out. Let's sort it out. Let's sort it out. Let me. Let's go. Let's go. Let me. I will meet you. Let me. Stop this, please. Where are you coming? Where are you doing this? Where are you doing this? Can you just stop? Stop what? Yes, sir. She's the one. See this one. You again? You will never chop again. You know what? But you are under arrest, and anything you say or do will be used against you in the law court. Okay. Officer, move it! Hey, oh, can we, how many people you chop? Move it! Yeah. Don't touch me! Oh, God, don't touch me! Oh, God, me. 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 Oh, The daughter of the almighty barrister, Bokumi Ojo, the senior advocate of Nigeria. Do not dare me. Before I press the hang of 
bought in on my phone. I want my daughter back in my house hard and hurdy. If not, I'll make you pull that uniform of yours. You know I can make you lose your job at the snap of my finger. You know that. I need my daughter back. And make sure you escort her home. Good day. Mobile! Ah, 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 ah. Don't feel me like you. Hey, Mobile. 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 Feel me like you. Ah, ah, feel me like you. Hey, what? Ah. Hey, Mobile. Mobile. Hey, ah. Dad. I am done. And this time, I am done for good. Mumbo, barista, just watch how your daughter want to bring down everything I have worked for down the drain. Just tune to Mega TV station and watch your daughter's shamelessness on display. Baby, just watch it, watch it, and forget every other thing. Ah, female. Hey, what? You could see what Hala. in showing your husband to be and this family how shameless you are but also to the whole world <sighs> mommy kilo shelly what have i done if you ask me that question again i will jam your head against the wall you lost on tempt soul <sighs> someone recorded you someone recorded you on art they recorded your idiocy and sent to one of the biggest bloggers in town who had it on television, on live TV. How could you? That person has to be arrested. Will you shut up? Masha Lesha! Masha Lesha! Just shut up your mouth. I saw the way you poured drink on that waitress and how you vandalized the property of the bar owner. How could you? Do you want to imagine what the headlines will be? That the daughter to the renowned barrister, Pokomini Ojo, the advocate, senior advocate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, was caught. Ah, ah, ah. I, was, I, I, I just don't want to imagine this. I don't want to imagine this. Kilo day. Kilo day, Fumi Layo, Kilo day. Listen, I've made calls. I've made calls for that clip to be brought down. Just pray that it works. Because if it doesn't, you have yourself to blame. Now get out of my sight. They looked at my trouble, mommy. Get, just get out of my sight. Get out. Mommy, get out. Out. Get out of my sight. They looked at my trouble. She was the one insulting my, my uncle me. Why would, why would she do that? And you hear just don't problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. How come I didn't say this? What happened? I didn't see this coming. Was it that I, 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 I sped the road and spoiled her? Oh, she's so untamed. How could she even... Please, leave my room. I want to be left alone. You don't blame me for hating you. I'm just a mother who wants the very best for her child. I cannot completely throw you away. I can only spank you with one hand and bring you back into my hands and cuddle you with the other. 
You hate me, Mom, and I'm so sorry. Just that I was very angry. I'm not angry because of what people will say, but because of what will be going on in Martin's head right now. I've been calling and texting him, but he's not taking my calls and he's not responding to my messages. <sighs> for me, Lola, I advise you to let him be for now. I can't. Mom. Of course you have to. I love him. I know. A lot has happened. I mean, a lot has happened at the same time. And if you keep pestering him, he will see you as a source of liability and that will not be good for your image. That wouldn't be good. Then he should expect me. Because I, for me, liar, I will be at his place first thing tomorrow morning. He will ask him why he's avoiding me. Lies. That's a lie. You will not do that. The daughter to the almighty barrister Bokomi Ojo will not condescend so low as loving a man who is not ready to express his own love to her. You can show him that you love him so much to die for him. It is not good for your image and you will not do that. And that's final. Try to comport yourself. I don't know what is wrong with you. Kilode. My honorable, honorable. <laughs> In fact, you are the incoming governor of Lagos State. <laughs> honorable. Yes. I got from my source that your political opinion, they had closed door meeting yesterday. But do you know what? All their strategies to win are at our own uh, favor. I want to tell you, the governorship of this state is already on your shoulder. <laughs> chief, chief, I must tell you, Amy Loco. Ah, 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 ah. In fact, we do not need to sit this and be talking without uh, drinking. Uh, so, Mumbo, uh, where is uh, Lucy? Where is Lucy? Uh, yes. Before that, before that, did you see? Uh, what uh, Bukumi's daughter were displaying in the live TV yesterday? Chief, the only thing I want to tell you is that it was such an embarrassing moment. To, but uh, we were so smart to have arrested the issue enough before the thing escalated. Uh, the truth of the matter is that the video clip has been permanently deleted from the media. <laughs> we need to be very careful about it. Uh, <laughs> we have to do something. This is not what we'll be sitting there and be talking with that drinking. All the <laughs> rebel. Lunch is safe. Do you hear that? <laughs> Let us go and wine and die. Ah, Baba me. Yes. I thought you were sleeping. I am not sleeping. I asked, where are you off to? Um, Baba me, actually, I am traveling. I'm going to the east. Uh, my site manager called me and he said he needs my urgent attention. Oh, Kosiwa Hala. Oh, yeah. Kosiwa Hala. Uh, don't, don't worry. You will go with a guy then. No, 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 no. That, 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 it's nothing. I, I mean, I can take good care of myself. Are uh, you seen, Martins? Maybe you need to be kidnapped first before you know whose son you are. Uh, Bansa, so you have to keep an eye on my son very well, Chuti Bo. I don't want all those kidnappers and unknown government to harm my son, Chuti Bo. Yes, sir. Ah, uh, Oh yeah. Keep an eye on him. Whatever is going, you give me an update. Sure, sir.
What are you doing here? Why have you been avoiding what me? What are you doing here? Stop touching me. What are, you, what are you doing here? Why are you embarrassing me in front of your guard? Why? Come. Baby, I've really missed you. I have. Why have you been avoiding me? Why can't you just read the handwriting written on the wall? Of course you should know I don't need you anymore. Here I am, trying to make this work, and you're saying you're done? Don't we what? What are you saying? From a liar. I am sick and tired of your dirty attitude. I cannot tolerate it anymore. As you can see, I want to head up somewhere. And this is not a good time for us to have any discussion. Babe. Uh, don't touch me, please. Stop. Come, we need to talk. Come. Can you leave me alone, please? Come, we need to talk. Stop this. Stop embarrassing me in front of your guard. I don't like it. You know I don't like it. Come. Excuse, 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 excuse. I trust It's okay. Fumilayo, I don't have anything to discuss with you. Please do yourself a favor by leaving this compound with this rickety car of yours. And do not step your foot in this compound again. Martins, do you, do you realize but, it's me, Fumilayo, that you're talking to this way? And you, what are you staring at? What exactly are you staring at? Babe, please. Do not touch me. What is wrong with you? Don't call me. It's me. Do not occur me at all. What is the point trying to fix something with someone that would destroy everything the next minute? I am sick and tired of you, Fumilayo. Let me be. And you should leave this compound this minute. I'll be forced to ask my bouncer to drive you away from this compound. Do you get my point? Martins. Martins. I'm not happy at all. I'm not. Why will Matis occur me? Treat me the way he treated me like I'm a nobody. He even insulted me in front of his guards. Ah, uh, he should just forgive me. He should just forgive me. Small forgiveness. I'm begging him. He just left me like that and went ah, away. Ah, ah, ah. Uh, <laughs> Hey, Nishiru. All Martin has been doing all the while you are together with yourselves is to forgive you and look down on your excesses. I will not blame Martin so if he said he had run out of forgiveness for you, Chobo. Oh, it's no fair. I'm only asking for one more chance. One more chance. Am I the only person that is a sinner? Am I the only person that he cannot forgive me? Why would Martin show everything we shared just like that? Why? Give me lie. <laughs> uh, uh, this was exactly the same thing you have been saying, Leo. And I have been going around telling my son to forgive you. Ah, uh, me tired you. I am tired and even have gone out of myself for asking my son to forgive you each time you come with your usury. <laughs> Me, I am tired, you know. So, Bob? Oh, Femi, please. Martin should just give me one last chance. I promise. I will just, I will do everything to make him happy. I will. I promise. I will never do anything to hurt him again. I'm very serious. 
Uh, uh, maybe I have to remind you that I'm a politician here, the next governor of Lagos State. And the one attribute that politicians as such as myself lacks is trust you. Me, I no trust anyone. I don't even trust myself in you. You have to go and work on yourself. All those rich, rich that you do, which make my son to look down on you, you have to work on that, yo. Uh, maybe on that reason, I will have to come to ask my son again to give you a second chance in you. I don't know how many chances I have been asking for. Chukbo? <laughs> Obey me, I have to do something. I, I don't need to stop and sleep. I just have to listen to you. But I didn't know this. All the things that you have been doing you have been going around the clock. Kill on shell, female. Where is your own repentance in it? I'm actually looking uh, for a route heading to Ndioku village. There's a road construction going on there. Um, there are so many routes you can take to that place. Okay. Um, um, do you want me to take you there? Oh, really? Yes. Uh, you can. Just hop in the car. Okay. okay. Where are you going? You want to follow him. I want to take him to where he's going to. Do you know if he's a ritualist? Do you know ritual? you want to enter his eyes? He doesn't look like a ritualist. Why are you like this? Amara! My fine boy. Let us go. Lotachi. Lotachi. Cherigodo. Wait. Martins. Lotachi. Uh -uh. Martins. We both know each other. It's you. Yes, it's oh me. Oh my goodness. Lotachi, come here. <laughs> That's you! Oh my goodness! What is so you can add weight in this life? Oh, no, please. you can get fat! Who is talking? Hey, hey. Look at look Martin so! Eh? You even have skinny, the beer! Skinny, skinny, lotachi and hey, all that! Let me hear, Joa! Ah, oh my ah. goodness, you look so pretty this period! I mean... Mm. Oh, oh, sorry! Pretty, quite. we both know each other! Yes, we do! Ah. He's my old school classmate! Uh, it's it's alright, it's alright! Uh, are you not still going there? Oh. Yes! Hey, it's okay. We uh, can take you to uh, where you're going. We to know the place, right? Which one is we? Uh, just hop let's, in the car, go. okay? Amara, I beg. <laughs> You're back. Welcome. And who is that young man I saw you coming down from his car? Um, he's an old school friend, Mama. He actually wanted to greet you and Papa, but you people were not around. So I told him when next he comes, he can say hi. You old time schoolmate? Yes. With that big car? Yes, Mama. Well, life has been favorable to everybody, except for us. Mama, it's okay. You don't have to refer to that. It is job. well. It is well. Yes, yes it is well. Let's go and make soup before your father comes back. Ah, but I hope you bought me some. <laughs> Fine. Uh, work was fine. Work was fine. Work was fine. So, I was with the female lawyer and she said that. Uh, uh, Baba me. Oh, no, why are you calling this name? Baba me, I don't want the rest of my day to be ruined 
by that name. Uh, I was only trying to. Uh, Papa, is okay. It's okay. Please, I, 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 I just decided to come and greet you. Yes. I was Trying you to help solve the matter. I think now your case is a very big one. So, how are you? What did you say? Well, like I said earlier, change is the only constant thing in life. So tell me, how is your sight? Oh well, I trust you. Tomorrow. Uh, sorry, I mean um any time that is um free for you. Oh okay. That's fine. Tomorrow is perfect. All right, you too. Okay, bye. Bye. Good night. <laughs> Mama. <laughs> this is your so called classmate. Are you sure it's just a classmate or there's something more attached to it now? Mama, don't you know it's rude for you to eavesdrop on people's conversation? Mm -hmm. Whatever. Just know that this your love will not kill that cassava behind the house. Mama, I am not in love with him. It's just a phone call and he's just my friend. When you finish loving, go and peel that cassava. The love that is written all over your eyes. Mama, it's just my S class mix. Ah, uh, Mama. Oh, okay. concentrated in anything you do. Nothing at all. You've become a shadow of yourself. You know what? You're just a bomb. A big bomb ready to detonate. And I fear for you. I, just, I don't know what you're turning in. Now, so listen. I'm sorry. Okay? I'm so sorry about this. Oh, you need to be very careful. Try... Anything possible to avoid from Ilayo. She's becoming something else. And when this happens, if I'm not around, thank I wonder you. what will happen. Clean this up. Kimo, thank you, Mom. Matachi, <laughs> how are you? I <laughs> I am fine. And you? No, it doesn't look like you're fine. Your eyes are swollen. Is everything okay? Well, I didn't sleep all through the night. Why were you walking throughout the night? 
I was lost in thought. <laughs> lost in thought? About what were you thinking about? Me. I was thinking about you. How? I mean, why? You see, Lotachi, I've always had these feelings for you. Even back then in our secondary school and our university days. But I couldn't summon this courage to tell you how I feel for you. <laughs> but you know, back in school, I was just a timid, short-sighted girl who, who hid behind other students. I mean, what, <laughs> what would anyone want to do with a girl like that? But actually, I don't know. But the truth is that I love you. Okay. But you know, back in school, you always fought for me. I mean, those who bullied me. Why didn't you say anything? Why didn't you tell me? I couldn't summon the courage to do so. Seriously. But the feelings has always been there. I mean it. Okay. The truth of the matter is I... I didn't sleep all through the night too. Why? I was... I was thinking about you. Yes. <laughs> I had a crush on you when we were back in school. I... I just couldn't say anything because... Everybody knew me as a weirdo. I mean... Who would want to be with me? Almost every student laughed at me. I just I just thought you wouldn't want to have anything to do with me, so I, I got scared and I couldn't say anything to you. I'm sorry about that, but I mean I'm so glad, I'm so glad. You, okay. Now we have this mutual feelings for each other. Um Lotachi, would you mind? If I ask you to be my girlfriend, please, I beg of you. I, I love you so much, more than words can express. Please. I am... Um... <laughs> okay. Is that a yes? <laughs> Is that a yes? Yes. Oh my god. Is that a yes? I, I... Oh my goodness. Just take, take it easy. You. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of happy. You know? <laughs> oh, you are compressing me, Martins. I'm, I'm, We're I'm, outside. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, never mind. It's, it's fine. I'm glad. I'm glad you accepted. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Hey! What is it? Wonder shall never end. In fact, my eyes have seen my illness. Hey! I'm not talking. I'm getting a panic attack here now. What's your problem? Oh, Lisa, it's not my talk, 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 talk. Are you not the one that warned me that I should not mention the, 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 the Lotashi's name in my mouth? Okay, if you want to talk, you talk. Which one is I? I, I don't want to hear Lotashi's name see, in your see, mouth. You are the one that told me that I should never mention her name before you again. Talky. Um, where? You should not be I'm a bad person. See, of recent, I've been, I've been seeing a uh, Lotashi and a uh, one guy in this village going together. So, and with the look of things, there's something going on between them. All. I'm I, telling nothing but the truth. My, my own Lotashi? In, in this village? Nayabu, nonsense! Nonsense! Who in this village that does not know that Lotachi is my future wife? Huh? Where's the guy, sir? Huh? Hmm. From the look of things, that guy is not from this village. Yes. And with what I saw, that guy is very rich. He has a big car. And it's not of my problem now. Uh, yeah? Which one is big car? It's not of my... He's rich in his pocket. Uh, see, see, you are here by the yeah, way. Yeah. You needed to hear this one. In fact, this is the most important part of it. I saw both of them kissing and hugging each other inside the car. You saw the guy kissing my, no, no, my not, Lotachi? Not just kissing, wet kiss. Kissing my own Lotachi? Oh. In this I say you my guy and I say that I should come back. Wait, 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 wait. Why is this one blushing? What is it? Blushing, I'm, 
Am I, am I blushing? As if you don't know. Now tell me. What is making you blush? What is the reason behind it? Talk to me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Mm. I'll tell you. <clears throat> I'm all ears. Martins asked me to be his girlfriend. <laughs> and what did he tell him? <laughs> yes, of course. What were you expecting me to say? What I mean to refuse him? You should have acted like a lady with dignity and some respect. Yeah. You should have. You should have told him to give you some time to think about it. At least time. Yes. My sister, did they think about love? A man that loves a woman, what is there for me to think about? Moreover, I wanted it as much as he wanted it. So why would I be thinking about it? So cheap, Lotachi. So, so cheap. You don't even know this guy. Like you know, Ulisa. And who said that? Better is the devil you know than the angel you don't know. Why would you say a thing like that? Do you know how much I know Martins? Listen, I have known Martins way, way longer compared to Ulisa. Martins and I attended the same secondary school. I've always had a crush on this young man. Even while we were in our university days, I that love never faded. It's always been in my mind. I have loved this man for a very long time. So why would I want to be with them? Um, what's his name? Olisa. Then Martins. But but what? My darling, there are no bots. And please, I will appreciate it if you stop mentioning that that's that dot's name anytime we are talking. I, I don't want anything to spoil my mood, as you can see, I'm very happy. Actually, actually if I will advise you, Olisa is the better guy for you. Auntie, think about it. Eh? I want to ask you. Yes, my darling. You've always had some reservations about Olisa. Mm -hmm. What changed? Nothing. I just realized that the guy is a good guy. Okay, your advice don't do, don't do. Don't, don't advise me again, it's okay. Hmm? Thank you. Hmm. Let's talk about something else. It's okay. Hmm. So if they can't leave small madam now, I suppose she can't make you lie down on top bottle. Which kind of wickedness be this one again? You know, even her own mother is scared of the stone she will pull next time. Because as the day goes by, she becomes more and more dangerous. Even ah, very frustrated human being. Ah. Hey. Oh, okay. So now we can't tell Oga Martin run leave her for his dear life. Hmm. Now so she can now pour all her anger on us. Innocent also. See, Romanus, just be careful. Be careful around her. Ha. Ha. If you see the way that woman did just pam me like this. Yeah. Bam. Oh. Hey. Hey. The way she does. I beg, be careful, be cool. Ma! Ma, I'm coming! Hey! Young man! I said leave the room! Why do you block my way for the shadow of my love? Are you asking me questions? Yeah? You don't ask questions. Yeah? So you, you don't ask questions as you, you walk into the star. Yeah? Nobody cares. You're only tax collector in the star. You don't have your face. One, two. Anybody that tries to steal my woman away from me, anybody that tries to take Lodachi away from me, when they are out of my own person, I don't want to do it. so. It's all about Lutachi. So, is that why you walk my way?
Oh, shit. My ear is ringing. Hi. That GP Tang guy is so lucky. He's very, very lucky that I've not eaten his money. If not, he wouldn't have beat me the way he did today. Uh, ah. this guy. Eh? Because you've not eaten. Just look at the way he was beating the three of us like kids. Eh? One person. In fact, the most painful part is Olisa. Look at the way you just punch him. You just land on that. Now listen. If he was able to defeat me, and also Adike, what about you, Olise? Eh? You'd have been able to, to at least show him some skills. You're very stupid. You're very, very stupid. So, I'm so ashamed of the both of you. So you couldn't save me from that guy. And I'm here calling you my guys. My men. Huh? You're expecting us to save you. We've not been able to save ourselves. You're expecting us to save you. So as old as you are, you cannot defend yourself. Eh? Or is it not because of you we went through all this? Get out of my house. You said we should leave your house. Go! I must you! Hold it there! What happened to you? When everything is how is that your business? Oh, it is yeah? my business quite alright. If all my guesses are correct, that means our villagers must have thrown ball to your face and those of your useless. Oh, leave my way. Leave my way now. And if I don't leave your I way, have what so will very important that I, I want to be now. And if I don't leave your way, what will happen? <laughs> Oh, my friends, stay there. Let me finish with you. Let me tell you one thing. You see, some few weeks ago, you were a crowd bragging on how you were to walk like a paper. If not, because of your touch. But you see, someone has made a threat to you, and he has made you straight. I like a that. Come on, get mad. What, what the fuck is the matter with you? Are you mad? You don't think that me I could win now. You can't You can't The only reason I am letting you leave is because of your guts. Otherwise, you would have been a dead man by now. Get out of my way. Look at, look at, what you doing? Leave my way now. He try anything funny, eh? You know me Maybe not a very big guy. Maybe not a very big guy. Huh? Who don't know how to walk in? You remember anything? Yes. Yeah. I am sure you must have provoked one market woman and she decided to set a trap for you. And when you think that, you just don't do it. Oh! That's a man that you are making love at that is with his wife. So you can go and look at it. Uh, because I can't make love at that is to your wife. Your wife is very ugly. What is that? Get out of here, yeah, my friend! Yeah, Get there, yeah, you come on thinking, you go. Get there, get there. Get there, get there. Get there. You may have that. I will just squeeze this your hand for you. You're welcome here. Look at this. Okay. Don't dare me. Don't dare me. Don't dare me. Oh, sorry, I didn't fall out. Mugga. 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 I know, sir. Come complete. Nene, nene, nene. Hehehehe. And you may be out. This is just a sample. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, you sent for me and you sounded as if someone was going to die. You said it was a matter of life and death. Obviously, nobody's dying here, so what is it? What's up, Dogu? Get off of it and wait for Am I supposed to teach you how to read handwritings on the wall? 
But I don't get a touch now. I say which touch? Oga, the battery of my torch is dead, so I cannot even on it. Say why you called me here. You said somebody was going to die, but nobody is dying here. What is it? Well, if you don't accept my proposal, how do you think I will leave? Huh? Okay, you will die. Baby. <laughs> well, be my guest. Because I don't even know what someone like you is still doing on planet Earth. You know, the funny thing is, I don't know why the good people just die like that and leave the bad ones to be causing nuisance in this village. Eh? This village will be better without people like you in it. So you hate me that much? Is it because of him? Because of who? Who are you talking about? Young I have ears everywhere. My boys have been telling me that lately they've been seeing you hanging around with one useless guy. Kissing and romancing, caressing behind the corner and in an uncompleted building, behind mango trees, behind banana trees. Are you are you that low? May the gods forbid it that I have anything to do with any man in a hidden corner. Me, hide. For what? Now let me make this clear to you. My man is very rich and capable of lodging me in one of the best hotels, both in this village and in the city. So why will I hide? No, I'm asking you. Unlike you village boys who does unimaginable things in those hidden corners that you were talking about. Moreover, you are not my father. So I owe you no explanation. Can I go now? Natasha, I'm a village guy. Yes, you are. But I'm a very big guy. <laughs> I can actually take care of you. What can we yeah? My thoughts now. My thoughts. Yeah? What can we now? What can we have now? Why are you treating me this way? Huh? Oh, I'm one now. Do go at attack. I can get the results. See, huh? If you accept to be mine, you will have upper hands in this in this community. What can we hear now? Yeah. What can we hear now? So I shouldn't be with him. Oh. No, you are the one to now tell me who to be with and who not to be. No, Negodu, just look at the person that is advising me to be with somebody. You want the the color riot? Uncle Rainbow. You are wearing red. You are wearing blue. You are wearing, and you are black. You now combine these outrageous colors on yourself with this your dog chain. And I'm sure it's not gold because if thunder strike now, it will strike you and this chain together. You are the one advising me on who to date and who not to date. I don't blame you. I can see you are taking advantage of my kindness. I walked all the way from my house under this hot sun to come and hear this nonsense from you. Oga, if you want to die, you better die because as it stands now, it's even better that you leave planet Earth than to be with us here. It is better you die. And last advice, you put this side class. I don't know whether you are forming Batman. Nay, we Batman. Look at what you're telling a very big guy. Don't worry. You see that guy? I will fight for your love. No one dares. I'm a very big guy. In case you don't know, no one dares. May may long mapas. I have been thinking. Thinking about what? You see, I didn't want to tell you about this because of its irrelevance. But strange things kept on happening. What is it? Can you just go straight to the point? <laughs> A guy that called himself Olisa <laughs> stopped me and attacked me with his friends. What? Yes. He even tried to cut me with a machete. If not that my bouncer had to, you know, hit them down. And that is not all. When I got home, I discovered that my glass was broken. It's a lie. It doesn't even stop there. I discovered that my tire flattened. I mean, it's really crazy. He said I should stay away from you. That's just what he said. I should stay away from you. You, wait a minute. You mean Olisa actually? Exactly. Uh, 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 hold on, babe. Where are you going to? I'm going to end the charade, of course. Oh, no, 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 no. Stop, stop, stop. 
Just let me go. Can you just stop? I it? said let me stop. go. Let me go. Stop. I'll find love. I'll find peace in you. You give me joy and happiness. Make nobody put us on. How dare you? How dare you and your lily livered jobless friends threaten Martins? How dare you? Not that you slapped me! And I will slap you again if you open that gutter you call a mouth. Oh! So you people were responsible for vandalizing his cars. You had to deflate his tires and shatter his glasses. Are you mad? Yes, we did. Because he was trying to take you away from me. And I will not let that happen. Not when I'm alive. Not in this village. A goat. He was trying to take me away from you. Was that ever yours? Your mind. Were we ever dating? <laughs> Three able bodied men were brought down by one single man. And that is the kind of man you want me to spend the rest of my life with a spineless man. When it comes to these old, weary, tired village women, you will raise your shoulder. Try to be the boss, want to be on top. But one man brought three of you down. Now, let me make this clear. If one hair, one strand of hair, on his head gets hurt. Huh? I promise you, I will use the last drop of my blood to bring you and your friends down. Bastard, and put that your chest down because you are not even a man. Nonsense. I'll kill him. If he dare tries to take you away from me, I will kill him. You are mad. Your this is my town. No one dares. No one dares! I will destroy him! You don't know me. We open an apple here. We open an apple, dollar and dollar. For me, where are you headed? Mommy. Mm -hmm. I'm going to Martin's house. To do what? Mommy, I need to go and have a word with him. I need to know why he hasn't even called me for a month. Four months, mom. No. Let me go and talk to him and ask him where this our relationship is headed. Because I don't understand. I don't. I told you to give him time. Give him space. So that he can be able to meet your presence. That will make him love you much more. Don't you know how to draw a man? I'm sorry, Mom, I can't do that. You want me to languish in uncertainty? I can't do that, Mom. One month I haven't spoken to my lover, my baby. Oh, call me. Oh, Emma Mio. Come. Listen, you are not going there. Learn to respect yourself. You? Will not go there. Watch me, Mom. You're not going anywhere. Get my khaki! Come up here! Alright, 
I tell you, my first hundred days in office, we flush all those who wish, wish, bad, bad, ex in Lagos State. They go in by jail. All the internally generated revenue must be complete. Very Anybody good. that is not functional, I will remove him. So, I will maintain this mantra. So, I will make sure that the internally revenated revenue must be complete. From all angles, the right people must be deposited there. Nobody will do anything that I will not like. Daddy, hey, Lisa. Daddy, me. Very smart things. Kiro Che, are you worried yet? Feel me like you. Are you insane or are you blind enough to see that men as old as your father are seated here and the only thing you could do to greet is to kneel down and you rise and ask me of Martin. I be wearing here. Daddy me, I am not here to greet anybody. I am here because I want to see Martins. Where is he? He needs to look me in the eyes and tell me the reason he hasn't even picked up his phone to call me for over a month. I need to ask him some questions. Let him look into my face. Yeah, I'll tell you why you have one word from you. I will say, oh my God, to beat you. Some sense in you. You don't I'm sorry. I'm sorry for your rational behavior, please. <laughs> Did you hear that? Hey, me, you feel what hello? You have to talk to your daughter. I am sorry. Martin! Will you shut your mouth? Yes, I'm here. What are you doing here? Martins, so here you are. Martins, how dare you? So you can stay without calling me for over a month. Why? I ask you. Why will you do that? For me, lawyer. For the last time, it is over <laughs> between us. <laughs> Martins, I think you have to have a rethink. You think I, Formula Yo, and me, Formula Yo, will leave you? I will never leave will you. Will you shut up? You shut up! Are you shut up? You know, Are you mad? I don't blame you. You know, you are very stupid. Oh, come on. But at this juncture, I cannot condone your stupidity. Alright? Bowser. Sir. Take this mad dog out of this compound and ensure she doesn't step her foot in this compound again. No, Do you no, get no, me right? No, 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 no. I take exception to insult. Now listen, you don't call my daughter names. Don't you ever in your life do that. Now let's go. Leave me, Martins! Martins, it will never be over between us. Did you hear me? Don't try it! Don't try it! Don't try it! Don't try it! I will strangle you, Martins! Madam, Martins! 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 Now get the hell out of this compound! You're this asking minute. me to leave your house! Come on, let's go! What the hell? Boss, I said you drag her away from here! Don't touch me! Move it! Don't touch me without your stupid, dirty sweater! Don't touch me! Let's go! Honorable, please, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry about this. Mm. Baba me. Show to me. Oh my God. So this is the mad woman you want your son to get married to. Ah, ah, honorable. I am only trying to secure my political career. Oh. This one is fire. Oh. I need to go and invite some firefighters to bring the extinguisher Burn. to extinguish this type of woman. No? Burn, your honor. This one, my son will not cross the house. So, what? If I allow this girl to be in my house, she's going to destroy my political career. So, what? Honorable Melbo, I knew she's smart the day I saw her on television. But seeing her in the real life here demonstrating simply tells me that she's more than mad. Hey, she Fimilayo. Fimilayo is not naked, but she's mad in you. Benny.
Please do me a favor. I want you to come to the house, pick for me Lyle's key, and get her car from Honorable Bologna's house. All right, then. I'll be waiting. Thank you. Mom! He looked me in the eyes and he said it's over. How? How can Martin say that, Mommy? How, Mommy? How? I told you not to go there, but you insisted. That's how. Did you, did you see the embarrassment? Martin embarrassed me in front of those stupid, demented girls of him. That can't happen. Who is talking about embarrassment? The almighty barrister Bukumio Joe's daughter was thrown out of someone's house before her mother. And you hear telling me about embarrassment when you gave me the height of it today. I wonder what Honorable Bolaji will be thinking of us. I wonder if he had atom, just an atom of love and respect for us anymore. I wonder why you doing this. Only God knows that I didn't train you this way. I wonder if our deal still stands or not. And you hear talking about embarrassment. Don't. Don't you ever mention that. That's all you care about. That is all you care about. Your stupid career. You should be thinking about your daughter's feelings. And all you care about is to fight. Fighting all the news and cranny of the state. Tell me where you've not fought one or two persons. Just mention it. Why are you bent on dragging my reputation to the mud? What is it that I've done wrong? Don't blame me. I just serves you right. I Oh, I know you think that uh, your father is doing what he's doing politically, just for his uh, political career. No, he's also doing it for the family and especially you. Listen, your happiness is important. That's why if you are not happy with a girl that he has designed for you, <laughs> very sure you're going to be frustrated. And your father will not be there to pass by you. Uncle, thank you so much. Um, actually, these are the words I need to hear. Thank you. That is why, if by the grace of God, Honorable Bolaji, your father, becomes the governor of Lagos State, which I know no Jupiter will stop him, then you have right to go for what you want. All right? All right. I think I'll be on my way. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Uncle. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Yeah. My dear. Do you know Olisa and his friends attacked Martins? It's just one of his bodyguards, just one, that beat up the three of them hands down. Huh. Are you saying that one man beat up three men? Three shameless men? Mm. Huh. That means Martin is wicked. Uh -uh. He is wicked and heartless. How can he order that his big masculine bodyguard to go and beat up harmless Olise and his friends? It's not nice. Yeah. Maybe he just wanted to dialogue with him. Okay, keep quiet. And nothing more. Hey, shut up. People that came to dialogue, they came with matchets. You, you, do you use matchets to dialogue? Which one is the one that's a dialogue? If not for the timely intervention of his bodyguard, only God knows what would have happened. What are you saying? Well, as for the machete, maybe they were going to the farm from there or something. But let's, let me tell you the gospel truth. Mm -hmm. ah, you touch my friend. Mm -hmm. 
Olise loves you so, so much. Mm. A man fights for what he loves. Yeah. And on top of it, he sustained injuries. Chai. Can't you see? Oh, ah. um, Chai. Poor Olisa. Very poor Chai. Chai. Poor one. Chai. Amara, and, um, stand up first. Eh? Hey, stand up from that place you are sitting. Hey, stand up. Hey, Ukao. You're asking me what is it? It's better you are standing now so that you will use your sense and think and talk like a normal human being. Because obviously you have been sitting on your brains. No, since you've been sitting down here, you've been sitting on your you don't have sense. Not that you. Eh? So are you trying to say that I'm now thinking from my anus? My darling, you are not only thinking from your anus, you have been talking from your anus. Because everything you've been talking here since is gibberish. What is wrong with you? I'm talking about love. We love from Olisa to you. Oli, Oli, you know, see the combination. If you were not my friend, I would have said your mother mistakenly gave birth to you. Don't let me call you bomb by, don't let me call you bomb by mistake. You see this, this edge of your nose is what is hungry me to come. If, if I, if I, if I, if I, if I, if I, know, if I, if I, I go no do. I go no do. See, I, clear your eyes. See Olisa, eyes, tall, handsome. Please. See, who no get sense, oh one not person. <laughs> Sumi, I've been on conference call for so long. I checked your room, you're not there. What are you still doing here? Why won't you eat up all this time? She's even sleeping. Fumi Layo. Fumi Layo. Get up. Get up, let me help you to your room. For me. Get up. Come, let me help you to your room. Get up now. I know you're not drunk. <laughs> Just get up. Come. Mm -hmm. oh, come on, big distance. Easy. Easy. I'll find love, oh, I'll find peace in you. You give me joy and happiness, make nobody put us under. Asunder, make nobody put us under. Asunder, I'll find love, oh. I'll find peace in you. You give me joy and happiness. Make nobody put us under. Asunder. Make nobody put us under. Asunder. No leave the sea. If it not be you. Ah. Jesus, Mama. <laughs> Hey, Mama. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Mm. My daughter. My daughter is in love. Huh. Mama, I am not in love. <laughs> I'm, I'm, we have started saying this thing again. I'm not in love. My question is with who? Hmm? With me. Mama, Mama, just stop, please. <laughs> Is it the same man that dropped you the other day? The one you said is your old time classmate? Ha! Mama, I said he's my classmate. I don't have anything to do with him. Mm, you do. I felt the same when I first met your father in Zimbabwe. Hmm. It felt so good. Are you serious? Yes. Isn't you know I met your father in Zimbabwe? Mother. When he was working in Zimbabwe, that's how he took me from my country to come here and yes, marry. Yes, but at least I just want to know how... You know how the feeling is, how you used to feel. Do you smile or laugh at maybe something you guys talked about some days ago? I mean, how, how did you feel? I just want to know. It felt so sure that is the one. Oh, 
I could see the perfection in everything, and everything seemed so right. Oh, Mama. You would feel it if he's the one. <laughs> he has two blushes. <laughs> so when are you introducing him to me and your father? Very soon. Okay, you agree now that you're in love. <laughs> Mama, stop. <laughs> My daughter is in love. <laughs> well, it's okay now. Why are you taunting me with it? But mm. you still did not tell me how you used to feel when you and Papa were together. Natachi. Mm-hmm. I want us to take us to another level. I don't understand. What do you mean? You don't understand. <laughs> well, I'll break it down for you. I want to come and see your people. Yes, you heard me right. I want to make you my wife. Wait. <laughs> Wait a minute, Martins. Are you proposing to me? You see, Lotachi, ever since I set my eyes on you, my life completely changed for good. <laughs> Lotachi, you brought in good tidings into my life. You never can imagine the peace the happiness, the joy I feel whenever I remember that I have such a damn cell like you in my life. Let me tell you something. I want to have you in my life so that whenever I wake up in the morning, I'll be seeing such a radiating beauty that if I'm to turn to my left, I see Lutachi. If I'm to turn to my right, I see Lutachi. <laughs> you see, babe, I am very serious about this. I'm not with Ring here because I did not know it would turn out to be like this. Please, make me proud the rest of my life by becoming my wife. Please, Lotachi, marry me. Please. Um, I I'm sorry, I, I can't. But I've got to see you! I mean, I, is, is, is that a yes? Of course Is that a yes? yes. Is that a yes? yes. <laughs> it's I love you so much. But yes! Oh my god. <laughs> I will marry you. <laughs> Honestly, I can't express you know, my happiness right now. I think there is the wrong place to express this. Just enter uh, the car. You, you should smile sometimes. This is good news. <laughs> smile. Enter the car. Welcome, my son. Thank you, brother. My daughter has told me so much about you. In fact, she told me that you attended the same secondary and university. Yes, Papa. <laughs> Actually, back then in school, Lotachi here used to be very skinny and um, thin. <laughs> I almost didn't recognize her when I saw her first, but I was able to recognize her with this a little what is? pink leaves. <laughs> Change is the only constant thing in life. Exactly what I told him, Papa. <laughs> Since you people reunited, all she does is think about you. <laughs> Mama now. <laughs> Espo. <laughs> anyway, it's good to finally meet you. You're welcome. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Papa. Go in there. And bring that special Okay. Agnes. Go and get the food so that we can all eat. Okay, sir. I consent to this union. Yes. <clears throat> Young man. Can you tell me about yourself? Tell me things my daughter is here to tell me about. Uh, Sorry. 
Let me go and help Mama. Okay. I'm all ears. <laughs> yes, Papa. My name is Femi Martins. And um Did I hear you say Femi? Yes, Femi Martins. Are you Yoruba? Yes, sir. I'm Yoruba. Hey! Over my dead body! Over my dead body! Will a Yoruba man come and marry my only daughter? Hey! Papa, I mean... Will you disappear from this compound? Now! Uh, uh, Papa, it doesn't go into that. I... I said disappear! Are you still here? No, sir. Come down. What is going on? Mama? Papa! Papa! What is Papa, what is it now? Why are you chasing me? Papa! Papa, what is it? What is it? Come here! What is it? Nani, what is it now? What is going on? Listen, if you see that Yoruba boy, tell him never to step his foot into this compound. Else I will use this knife to cut him into countless pieces. A Yoruba boy coming to ask for my only daughter's hand in marriage. Abomination. <sighs> take this off my side. Take, take them. Take them. The chair. Come. I don't want to say it. Honey, you calm down. You're coming down. The two people are in love. Just calm down. What happened? What happened? I saw you that you run after a very handsome young man like that. So I decided to come here to confirm what happened. Tell me what happened. Imagine. Yes. Lutachi, my daughter. Mm. My only daughter. Yes. Had the guts, mm. the temerity mm. to bring a Yoruba boy here. Mm. Asking me to approve their marriage. Imagine the insult. The gods forbid. My niece will never marry anybody like this. You film man of people. Mm -hmm. No, she will never do that. Mm -hmm. But brother, you are the one that defaulted. How? If you were proactive enough, you could have used that machete too. Mm. Uh, uh, nah, are you encouraging your brother to commit murder? No, I'm not encouraging my oh. brother to commit murder. No, no. What I'm saying is that if he kills an open man of man, that's a Yoruba man. It's not murder. It's just pest control. Hmm? Yes. But don't worry. I know where he's hiding. When you go there, chop off his neck, mm -mm. and wear Billy to his people. When they see it, they will know that we mean business. Mm -hmm. And no Yoruba man will ever come closer to an Igbo girl, say he will marry that girl. Mm -hmm. Never. I mean it. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. Today is his lucky day. Yes. But by the time he comes to retrieve this car, mm -hmm. he will not escape. It's a promise. Now you are talking, my brother. That's no problem. If not that this car belongs to a Yoruba boy, I will have used this motor to do a kind of show off in this village so that some people will start respecting me. <laughs> nah, can you drive? I cannot drive, but at least I can use this one to practice and learn how to drive. <laughs> you said that I cannot use it. Calm you just down. because it's a Yoruba person in the car. Calm down. After all, your brother married all the way from Zimbabwe. Did we chase you? <laughs> but you people are not from Yoruba. <laughs> they are two different things. So Zimbabwe and the Yoruba, they are not alike. Make nobody put us under, asunder. Make nobody put us under, asunder. Madam Atis, yes. Thank you for patronizing us. Oh, you're welcome. Anytime. And this your friend is very beautiful. Oh, you and can say that again. Simple as well. Not like that last time that you got the most stranger. Would you shut up? Uh, who is she talking about? <laughs> Don't mind her. You know, she talks too much. Hmm? Don't listen to whatever she has to say. Bye bye, ma. Don't listen to her. Come bye on. Bye bye. Ah, she no. just mentioned something. She, she, she talked about a girl. I say, don't listen to her. She talks too much. All these girls, all these random girls, they can talk anyhow. 
She talks too much, okay? Don't worry, let me just open the door for you. Don't mind her, yeah? My angel. <laughs> 